And the countdown is on to Christmas, so if you're still finishing up your shopping, you could get into some trouble and spend way more money than you're supposed to. Our queen of free, Sherry Lowe, is here with some strategies to help you stick to your budget. What do we need to know about gift cards? So gift cards are a great gift, and especially in this last moment when you're feeling the pinch, there are plenty of ways to purchase them. If you're going to buy any sort of restaurant gift card, it's smart to actually go to the restaurant rather than buying them from a big box retailer because the majority of them are offering promotional bonus gift cards. So you mm -hmm. buy one, you get an extra amount either to keep or to give as a gift. And I always like to go out and see if there's a coupon too to print out to go with those gift cards, help the recipient save a little extra money. Or even you can get some gas points too. Some yes, places offer definitely. that as well. Yes. Why are bath and body kits so good to buy? So this week, the retailers that know you're going to be in the store last minute shove all of those to the center aisles and drop their prices low. So look for things like bubble bath and lotion that are in those packaged kits, as well as toothpaste and toothbrush too, which is kind of fun mm -hmm. and practical as well. Buy those while they're cheap right now, maybe for the a gift, but maybe just to put back in your household supply too, because you'll not find cheaper prices throughout the year. I don't like this next one, but you said don't buy gifts for yourself. Right. So it's very, very tempting in these <laughs> final hours to feel the pressure and just repeating to yourself, you know, mm -hmm. that I don't need this item, especially if it's holiday seasonal decor. You know, in a week you're going to be putting it away. So don't buy things for yourself in these final minutes. And we shouldn't buy ugly sweater, Christmas sweaters right now, but there are some winter items that you would recommend buying now. Definitely, and I actually wrote this before I knew the forecast, but mm -hmm. gloves, boots, hats, those practical items, mm -hmm. um, long underwear, things like sleds, because the kids will have a great time with those. Those go quickly during the months of January and seem to disappear. So if you can find them when you're out and about, they make great gifts that are practical, not just junky things that people are going to throw away and for to get about in a week. I'm so guilty of this last one. Don't buy just one more gift. Right. I know that it, you keep this grand total in your head probably of who you've spent how much on and mm -hmm. how many gifts you have for which person. And so it kind of leads us into this endless cycle of maybe just sure. one more thing. I need one more thing to even the things out. And, you know, you have to stop at some point. So <laughs> it probably is the time that if you've purchased something already, mm -hmm. just stop, just quit, take a deep breath. Or if you do need to fill in those gaps, even Amazon, while they're delivering 24 hours or up to midnight tonight, rather, with Amazon Prime now, mm -hmm. you can buy those gift cards online, too. Mm -hmm. Skip the snow. You can even text them now. It's super simple. So you can buy things for people, but don't get caught up in just trying to get one more thing because it never ends. All right. We'll keep those in mind if we have to head out to the store today. <laughs> Thank you, Sherry.